a special moment for the Valade family. That's Ryan in the middle as he gets honored and uh, first time to Coors Field. Will not be the last time, I'm sure. And Ryan joins us uh, up in the booth. I knew a guy who wore number two, wore it pretty well in a Rockies uniform. And that is fouled off. Troy Tulowitzki. Ryan, how you doing, man? Doing great. Uh, just happy to be here. Honestly, yeah. this is awesome. Have you been to Denver before? I've flown into the airport once, but besides that, no, I've not been to Denver. Well, if you fly in right now, when you get on the train, Bud, Bud Black, Black. Right. he tells you, welcome to Denver and, and go Rockies, that sort of thing. Right, yes, sir. Yeah. Hey, Ryan, did you have any idea that the Rockies might draft you when it, when it came to draft day? You know, we... A little bit, yes. I, th I knew they were one of the, the teams that were interested in me, and then once the, the spot was open, they, uh, they drafted me, and I couldn't be any happier. So it was awesome. You are a coach's kid. Yes, I sir. know you grew up in the, in the Dallas metro area, right. and for your senior year, you went to Stillwater High School. Yes, sir. Your dad uh, joined the Oklahoma State staff. I don't want to embarrass you and ask you for a self-scouting report. We've seen you swing <laughs> on, on video. I know you have tremendous pop. Um, you're an athlete, played in the middle of the infield. Right. What other attributes do you think you bring to the table? Uh, I think my, you know, the way I handle myself on the field, my leadership, uh, the way I play the game, uh, I always, I think one of the big things I really take pride on is like the, the smartness of the game and knowing what, what to do, when to do it, and just helping other teammates out and, uh, you know, just kind of leading the infield and the lineup. We talked to a lot of different scouts and players and the way that the game's changed, a lot more select tournaments. I know you had uh, a great deal of press when you were in the Home Run Derby at Wrigley Field. You ended up winning the Home Run Derby. You were hitting balls into Waveland Avenue. What, what, what were those experiences like for you? Well, those were experiences I'll never forget. Uh, you know, going to the Home Run Derby was pretty incredible to be selected to, you know, play or I guess compete in the Home Run Derby against some of all the guys that you saw go first and second round of the draft this year and uh, end up winning it was really cool and then also playing with them on Team USA and winning a gold medal uh, that, those are something I'll never forget for sure. How many of those guys are you, have you kept in contact with? All of them we have a group message and uh, we're always texting each other so yeah we're really close it's a good bunch How much do you know about the guy who's coming to the plate right now? Do you want uh, you guys? Yeah, I know he's a stud. And right. uh, it's been, you know, fun watching him and dropping bombs and playing great third base. <laughs> he's definitely one guy that I look up to to hopefully be like whenever, uh, you know, I'm, I'm here, hopefully. Hey, Ryan, what piece of advice, uh, of I'm sure many pieces of advice that your dad has imparted to you, what, what do you remember most? What sticks with you the most about what dad's told you as you've grown up as a player? Yeah, the one thing that's really stuck to me is you got to get better every day somehow, some way, uh, whether that's studying film or working on your swing. There's something you have to do every day to, you know, become a better player. And that could be eating healthy if you're in the off season, or uh, just studying the game, getting good night's sleep. All those things matter. And I think those are the things that, you know, I'll take, especially in, a, in the minor leagues, you're going to be traveling a lot. So that's a big part of it. What are you most looking forward to as you begin your, your career, your professional career? Uh, you know, playing every day. You know, you know, in high school you play, you know, Monday, Tuesday, and then you have the rest of the week off. I'm ready to, you know, play every day. So if you have a, you know, get a lot of bats and uh, a lot of repetition, and just you know, meet new people, explore uh, new parts of the, you know, the country, and because uh, this is my first time going to be in like the the Colorado, Utah, right. Montana area. So. Yeah, it'll be cool. There'll be a lot more mountains than Oklahoma, I'll tell you that. Yeah, yeah. So. You like the outdoors a little bit? I do. I like to me and my brother are big fishermen. We like to go, you know, fish in our pond and uh, it's uh it's fun. Hey sure. Ryan, you're gonna love it in this area. We yes, can't sir. wait to see you here on a regular basis. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank, Thank you so much. Yeah. Fun. Thank Top you, pick sir. for the Rockies, yeah, Ryan Delay.